have a very special I'm, honor. I am. I'm presenting to Fergie tonight, which I'm really excited about. Um, a very well-deserved award for her, the hardest working woman I've ever met in my life. So I'm, I'm super thrilled to be here. You guys first, did you guys first become friends on 9? No, no, I've known Fergie since I was 19. The first time I met her was uh, in L.A., I mean, a decade, over a decade ago. Can you tell us a little bit about her? I mean, we certainly know her as this music icon on the screen. And what is she really like? She is... <laughs> um, well, I never thought I'd meet a bigger flirt than me, and she is definitely who takes the cake. I mean, she she is quite a flirtatious girl. I always say, like, people go, you're such a flirt, and I go, well, I flirt with everybody. I flirt with girls, I flirt with guys. Fergie, I mean, forget it. So that's that's uh, that's one thing about her that I love. Uh, she's got an incredible optimism. I mean, she's constantly going, and yet she still maintains this sort of spirit and vivaciousness and uh, she's just full of life you know and she's real so then you have this kind of fabulous stage presence and then you have this girl who's just sort of fun and a girl's girl and you know has all the same insecurities as we all do and you know she's just a, a, a real girl you know never lost where she came from I like that I like that and for glamour, can you tell me your definition of glamour? What does that mean to you? Ever? Oh, there's so much. There's all sorts of glamour, types of glamour, you know? There's the, there's the, there's the, I mean, to me, I would say, I mean, what glamorous is, is to be, you know, fabulous, you know? Uh, uh, but then, then you have sort of um, uh, elegance, you know? There's an elegant glamour, and then there's a, flashy glamour there's all sorts of, you know I, I, I you know Fergie says it best in her song right doesn't she have a song about glamour <laughs> yeah she does thank you so much okay oh my gosh I mean it's such a wonderful night I mean wow all these wonderful women I mean I'm, I've just I was just watching her on Mad Men you know last week and I'm dying all these wonderful women very strong women and that's what I'm about so it's such a great night and I'm just so blessed to be honored for this. Huge year for you. I mean, can you even get a head, your head around, wrapped around all that you've done? No, I cannot get my head wrapped around everything that's going on. It's 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 crazy. It's a, it's like a wave that I kind of jumped on as a surfer, and I've I've kept on surfing and kept on surfing and tried to not lose my balance, and sometimes I have, but pretty much stayed on the board and. <laughs> And I've made it here, and I got to bring my mom and my sister. Come say hi. Hi. Dana, and this hi. is Mama Terry. Mom. Hi. <laughs> yes. That's a question I want to ask. We're celebrating 20 years of the Women of the Year Awards. I know. What were you like at 20? What were you like the age of 20? <laughs> at 20? Uh. <laughs> Experiencing your freedom. Yes. Uh, I was just trying to get into the clubs that were 21 and over. That's what I was doing at 20. Yeah. Mom was trying to get out as a teenager. Oh, no. She was great. Great. What am I? Woman of the Year. She's, I'm so glad. Absolutely. I'm so proud. You're such a confident woman, and you certainly express that in your music. And you're Thank you. I notice a lot of people. Where does that come from? Where does that confidence really come from? Well, I have a good upbringing, and uh, my parents did a really good job. I have a great sister, the best in the world, so supportive. Always her audience. Yes, but <laughs> no, but always just there for me on a real level. You know, on a, forget forget all the cameras and the lights, just as a sister, and you know, we can talk about you know my utmost deepest fears and, and secrets and she can tell me hers and it's just wonderful and you know I've got a wonderful family and uh, that's where it comes from. Can you tell me upcoming projects you're working on? Upcoming projects. We have a new album called The Beginning for the Black Eyed Peas and uh, my shoe line Fergie Footwear and my fragrance Outspoken. I've got the next one coming out soon. So. Very exciting.
Right here. Right here. Right here. Thanks, Bernie. 